And the extreme heat is also bringing people together with several charitable organizations trying to provide some much needed relief. Crem 2 Shannon Mowdy caught up with some volunteers for Cool Spokane. She joins us live now with more on what they're doing. Shannon. Well, I am right outside City Hall. We are just across from the Skate Ribbon. This is one of Cool Spokane's temporary cooling centers. Now they are handing out cool drinks. I've been drinking this one thanks to these guys. They're handing out personal sprayers. They've even got these cooling neck towels that they are giving out all for free. Everyone's just trying to find relief from the heat. So in a scorcher like Tuesday's, there may be no two words sweeter than... Water? Yes, I would. And it's free. Free water. Just what volunteers like Dave Billsland are serving up with Cool Spokane. It, it's above politics. It's above religion. It's above everything. It's humanity at stake here. We are saving lives. I know exactly. It's yeah. super hot. Whether you're sipping it. Yeah. yeah, and it's like barely noon. Or <laughs> spraying it. A glass. Billsland says he's braving the blistering heat because of his belief Quality H2O is a human right. Because human beings need water. And we're happy to give it. I don't care who you are, I'll give you water. So sweet relief will be on tap as long as Mother Nature keeps turning up the thermostat. Free water. We'll be out when it's this hot, when it's above 95, we'll be out here handing out water. Because it's important. Thank you. Thank you. How are you doing? You too. Have a great one. Again, the Cool Spokane Temporary Cooling Center. This one's set up right outside Spokane City Hall, and they are expected to be here until 7 o'clock tonight. They usually set up around noon, and they are anticipating being out here Wednesday and Thursday. Shannon Mowdy, Prem 2 News.